Hello, this is Stampy, and welcome to a Minecraft Let's Play video. Another video inside of Stampy's lovely world. <laughs> Today in this video, as I'm sure you already saw, uh, I'm being joined by M2, uh, who decided to sneak into my bedroom. It's okay, you're allowed to come in. <laughs> and I'm also being joined, as always, by Alpha Lee, everybody's favourite big brown bear. And he's now going to be giving me everybody's favourite big tasty breakfast. <laughs> I was almost going to say dessert then, but uh, if you say you're having cake for dessert for breakfast, it sounds weird. So uh, I just say I'm having cake for breakfast. <laughs> anyway, what we're going to be doing in this video uh, is heading over to my fun land to build a massive pot of gold. Uh, but before we do that, I'm going to head over to my love garden and I'm going to go and give someone a shout out. And today I am adding uh, Bam is my account. And uh, that's because a comment that they left on one of my videos that said, I am casting a spell on this comment. Adds a dash of orange wool, a few petals from a lovely jubbly love love petals, a few whiskers, a dash of bad puns, the tears of dogs, and a slice of cake. Boom! And this comment will now be seen by Mr. Stampy Cat. And it worked! His spell did work, and I did read the comment, and it made me laugh enough, so I'm adding you to my love garden. So, Bam is my account. Welcome to my love garden. <laughs> and we're now going to go and uh, head over to my fun land. And I think what we're going to do now uh, is another race. Uh, me and Lee have started a new little tradition of racing uh, to my fun land. And uh, we've come up with a new way of doing it. And uh, the way we're going to do it is I'm going to go in a minecart. And Lee is going to go and try and ride over there in a boat. And it's going to be the first person to touch the rainbow wins. Uh, but first I'm going to pick which dog I'm going to take with me today. And I think I'm going to take... I think I'm going to take Duncan with me today. And Duncan uh, is the one all the way over here with the... um. Uh, the dark patch there. You see he's got like a darker patch of wall on his back. Uh, that's the way you know which one's Duncan. So uh, have you got a boat ready Lee? Are you ready to race over to the fun land? I'm feeling confident about this one. Uh, I don't know why. Like I think that boats might be slightly faster. Uh, but I don't know. I reckon that. I reckon if I'm quick and I lean really far forward in the minecart. Uh, I might just be about able to make it there quicker than Lee. Okay so we both start here Lee. I'm going to say three, two, one, go. You're going to ride over and go in your boat. And I'm going to go in the minecart. So three... Two, one, go, 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 go. All right, there we go. I didn't try and cheat at all in this way. I didn't try and trick saying one, two, three, go. All right, let's get straight into the minecart and let's go, 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 go. All right, Duncan, do not get in my way, please. Please do stay well behind me as we go off. And I forgot how slow it is. I have actually found out uh, that they're going to be updating Minecraft very soon. And uh, they are actually going to be increasing the speed of minecarts. So, uh, yeah, once title update 13 has come out, uh, then these races should be a little bit more in my favour. But for now, uh, it's still going to be pretty close. And where is Lee? I can't actually see him. I think there's M there. I think M's the uh, the the red one. And I think I just about took over her. Uh, but I have no idea where Lee is. Uh, I, th I think it might be quite close because we've still got to run all the way to the rainbow. And I think that's going to be my, my best chance to try and catch up some time. So ready? Three, two, one, go right jump out go 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 where's the stairs i'll get up i'm wasting time right get out of the big happy smiley tree and there's m m just overtook me m got here quicker than i did and she was just running right it's a freeway race then am i going to be able to take over m i wish i got a swiftness potion or something look at us both jumping on our way down i think i'm just about to go and overtake m oh she's got stuck i think she got stuck i managed to overtake her i think her shoelaces were undone or something where's lee though that's the important one. Oh, he's already there oh he just got he just touched the rainbow i wasn't even close wasn't even close right might as well go touch it anyway but you win lee well done you win and i got your prize for you right here you can have um you can have a pork chop there you go Oh no, that, that's my bow and arrow. You can't have that, but you can have a pork chop. There we go. There, there's your big grand prize. <laughs> so what was the score now then? I think that you won the first go, then I won the second, and then you won the third. Which means, hopefully, next time I'm supposed to win. If the uh, if the pattern continues, then I should be able to win next time. He's saying no. <laughs> I say yes. M says moo. Uh, Duncan says woof. <laughs> Anyway, as you can see here, this is the uh, the rainbow that we built in the last video. Uh, since then, I added some torches to it. Uh, I also fixed it so you now actually land on the rainbow. At the end of the last video, I tried to ride it and I fell short and I landed about there instead of on there and I died. And so instead of moving the rainbow, which would have took like absolutely ages, I made it so the, uh, the cloud fires you off faster. And so you should fingers crossed, uh, be able to land on top of the rainbow. And then what we're going to do down here 
is build a big uh, pot of gold. So we're going to do a massive pot. The gold is only going to be yellow wool uh, because I'm sadly not rich enough to fill it full of real gold. And so I had to move all of the sheep over here and I've dyed them all uh, black and yellow, black and yellow, black and yellow. So uh, yeah, all we need to do now is go and build the big pot of gold. And I definitely want to uh, try and get it done be uh, before the end of the video. So then we can have the first real ride uh, on the uh, the raindrops. And the last video was supposed to have the first real ride, but um, yeah, it didn't actually work. So uh, hopefully this time it will. So... Uh, I'm not very good at building things like this because, um, yeah, just because I'm not very good at them. So um, hopefully I can make this look uh, kind of like a big pot. I think I kind of just need to do it uh, how I built the um, the big fish tank. Uh, if you ever saw that for my dunking booth, I had to build a big fish tank. So uh, I guess it's just going to have to be uh, pretty similar to that. But I don't want it to be too big uh, because if it's too high... Uh, there's a chance you won't land in it. I kind of want you to, to fire off the edge of the rainbow a bit and land in here. So it, it can't be uh, too big. So uh, hopefully it shouldn't take too long. Oh no, oh no, M run, run, Duncan, sit down. Duncan, sit, sit, Duncan. Come on, good boy. Have a pork chop. There we go. He should have chilled out now, M. It's okay. <laughs> there's always the dangerous thing when you're trying to build things or destroy blocks and there's people running all over the place. <laughs> so yeah, it doesn't want it to be too big. So I guess if I just go up uh, in a box like this... And then, um, I, I think it can't even be much bigger than this, really. I think this might be okay. Then if I just go up here a bit and then make it go out, maybe, like, in, like, all directions uh, to make it look like a bit of a lip. And then we're just going to, on the inside, fill it full of, um, sand. And, uh, that's supposed to be, like, the gold. And then I think as you land, it will probably, uh, break your boat. And so then that way, uh, yeah, it should like, I don't know, be an easy way just to get rid of your boat so you don't have to leave it there. And Duncan doesn't sound happy, does he? I can hear him somewhere growling all over the place. <laughs> Maybe it's best if you uh, stay inside of the um, uh, the pot of gold M for now. <laughs> I think she might have just got stuck down in there. And I'm a little bit worried that this might be too small. I think it should be okay, though. I think this, uh, this should be all right. And then we just need to... Uh, I, I think this is probably high enough, actually, as well. So if we just make it go out... Uh, the whole way around the outside like this and then the water should go straight in I'm a little bit worried about what's going to happen as I place wool round here where the water's going to go oh that's okay actually it just sort of stops it down there if we put like a ladder here or something uh, it might just stop the uh, the water going down there I don't know how much is going to look like a pot of gold but uh, it should be okay and we can sort of get rid of some of the uh, the corners and stuff to make it uh, look a little bit more rounded and then all I need to do is go and fill the entire middle in, uh, in with water uh, so if I go and put uh, a row of sand the whole way around here, and Lee, if you could go grab some um, some buckets of water, uh, we can go and fill the uh, the whole middle in here. Then once I get rid of this wall and uh, build it again lower down, uh, the water should stay there. So uh, I'm going to go down here. Now, that doesn't need to be uh, built up anymore there, Lee. If you can, just try and place some water. I think, yeah, there we go. I got a few uh, down in here. Actually, let me take that. The, uh, the gold back. Uh, no, no, look, there's Duncan still chasing M. <laughs> run, M, run, right, sit down, Duncan. Duncan, sit, sit, good boy. Behave, Duncan, behave. <laughs> it's all right, she's friendly, she's friendly. I think it's because I keep feeding him pork chops and stuff. Don't tease him, don't tease him, M. <laughs> right, okay, let me go and try and get back on here. You don't need to build it up anymore, Lee. Uh, you just need to place the other uh, water now. We built it all. Right, if I just use some... Um, uh, dirt up here and then I can go and try and nerd pole up to the top and then once I place the water in and delete it down a bit uh, we should be okay oh, I think Lee was making an infinite water source <laughs> very elegantly done right there on the top Lee <laughs> I suppose I don't know uh, where else we would have been able to do it uh, I don't think actually we actually need too much water so let me fill up these uh, buckets again and if we get rid of this uh, then yeah it should be almost done then we can have the uh, the first official go and then the only other thing that I need to do is uh, do like some sort of entrance. Uh, like at the moment, you kind of just go straight into it. Uh, but I want some sort of fancy way to, to start the ride off uh, would be quite cool. And so once I've done this, I'm going to go over there and try and build that. But first I need to get rid of this wall here because uh, I think it might actually have to be a bit deeper. I think if it's that shallow there, then there's a, a good chance you're going to die as you hit it. So if I get rid of that there and uh, just go and start putting down some uh, some white wall, uh, yellow wall, sorry, all down the bottom here. Uh, it kind of looks like a pot of honey, doesn't it? Rather than uh, a pot of gold. I might have to put up a sign on it saying that it's gold, just so you know. <laughs> like, I, I would love to do real gold but I just simply don't have enough of it and so yeah if I just put a few blocks sort of randomly around there and then we could have some like on the top up here as well I think I need to uh, build this out a bit more here then we could just do like random bits of gold like all over the top as if it's like spewing out we could do like a staircase like a gold staircase leading down and that's uh, gonna be how you get out so if I do like just some gold 
uh, just sort of randomly all around the top here. Just as if it's like overflowing with gold. That could look pretty awesome, actually. If I do some uh, some more maybe there and some there or something, then have it like all going down the side down here. And then this could be like uh, how you get out of the ride, maybe, uh, without having to, to break your legs as you drop down. So uh, I need to kind of like... Uh, I, think, I think this will do, okay? It doesn't need to be a proper staircase. And then what I might do is I get rid of some of these corners here, and then that way the, the whole thing might look um, a little bit more rounded and not like a, a big, massive blob. So if I get rid of um, here as well... And then I could get rid of the uh, the corners there. Then hopefully this will look like a big pot of gold. I think this looks okay. I think this is this looks okay considering like how fast we built it, you know. And so uh, what you expect at the bottom of a rainbow is a big pot of gold. And so yeah, that's what we're going to have here. And then uh, if we all go to sleep very quickly inside the uh, the Rubik's cube, and then in the morning we can go and uh, be the first three people uh, to ever play uh, raindrops when it's completely finished. So I'm just going to scatter a bit more gold over the place, make it like it's uh, completely overflowing with gold. Make myself look completely rich you know <laughs> and uh, I think this looks pretty awesome uh, let me just go up here and just make sure that uh, you are gonna survive the fall I, th I think you should do uh, I could actually if I get rid of uh, this here I could actually have a bit more water here then that way you should be able to uh, to land in here it might make it uh, just that extra bit safer you know because um yeah every time I've tried to do this uh, pretty much apart from once um, I've died doing it so uh, I think the the more chance I've got of actually landing in the water the better so if I get rid of uh, a bit of the um the black wall around here and oh no that was one block too many uh, that's all gonna spew all over the place and then yeah if we fill those those edges in uh, with water uh, then yeah, there should be just a, a bigger area for us to land into. So if I get some uh, buckets of water here, and uh, yeah, we can go and uh, fill the, the entire thing in. Is this okay? I, I think this looks alright. Uh, I think that I need to get rid of, I think, here as well, just to make the, uh, the entire thing symmetrical. But it doesn't matter too much for now. As long as it works, and as long as you survive the fall, uh, then that will be enough for me. Uh, so yeah, if everyone goes inside the, uh, the Rubik's Cube now and goes to bed, and uh, then in the morning... Uh, we can go and have the first ever ride and then I should have a bit of spare time as well to um uh, to go and uh, try and hopefully build the, the start of the ride. Uh, can you please stop teasing Duncan then? <laughs> you know he's getting very worked up today. That's it, I'm going to make him stand up. Right, get get a Duncan, get a Duncan. <laughs> only joking, only joking. Right, everyone, let's go to bed quickly over here. It's okay, Em. It's okay, Em. He's sitting down. It, it's all safe again. <laughs> we can go inside here. Uh, go, go to sleep so it'll be a bit safer. And then in the morning, uh, we can go and have our first ride. So I'm going to very quickly now uh, go and craft uh, a few boats. Um, the reason I'm crafting a few rather than just one is because um yeah I don't want one to break while I'm up there then have to come uh, the entire way back down and then the entire way back up again and uh, while I'm going up I guess I can uh, have the uh, the spare time while I'm rising uh, to think about what I'm going to do at the bottom and what does this say here check out Minecraft FPS on YouTube Okay, I don't know who Minecraft FBS is, but oh uh, yeah, apparently you need to go check them out. <laughs> uh, so let's go and ride up here, uh, up the uh, up the water elevator, and uh, go and see uh, what the the first ride is going to be like. I tried to design it so that while you're rising, uh, you don't have to press any buttons, and so if I don't press anything on my controller, I should hopefully hopefully land in the middle of the rainbow but last time I tried that I uh, undershot it so I'm going to be ready to to change my uh, my aim in case I need to <laughs> and then, then look can you see all my see all my ocean can you see like how empty it all looks like you can't see the water through the glass and so the uh, the entire world looks really weird right then so let's think about how to do the entrance I think like a rainbow tunnel could be quite cool it could be like um like a water tunnel that you ride your boat down and then you just sort of turn then ride into here because uh, sometimes it can be really awkward trying to place your boat and get uh, into the uh, the elevator. So I think that uh, I should try and make it as easy as you can to ride in. Uh, but anyway, uh, we can think about that once we've landed. We have now arrived at the top of raindrops. I can see the, the first cloud here. So the plan is we drop down from this cloud onto the second cloud and then land graciously on top of the rainbow, and then we'll go down and land on the pot of gold. So, so far, so good. And here's the time when it all counts. This is me here falling as a raindrop. Woo! <laughs> it's so much fun. Am I going to land? It's looking good. It's looking good. And I did it, and I made it, and I survived. And I'm here sliding down the rainbow. Will I land in the pot of gold? I did it, and it worked. It destroyed my boat, like I said, but it worked. I managed to land inside of the big pot of gold. That was awesome. That worked perfectly. And here's Lee. Here, Lee made the perfect landing as well. <laughs> you need to get ready to swim so you don't drown. Is M coming? Uh, I think M might be a little bit behind, but that worked so well. That was so cool. Then I just need to go and jump down the gold. And that is it. 
There, that is Raindrops ride almost completely done. Ah, okay. <laughs> I guess Em might have pushed in a direction on her way down, but um, okay. It almost worked. Two out of three ain't bad. I kind of want to go again. I kind of want to not worry about having to go into the thing. Should we all have another go? I know what we can do. We should have a challenge. Who can land straight into the pot of gold, okay? I'm going to make another spare boat just in case some of my other ones break. But uh, yeah, we've got to try and land. We've got to not land on the rainbow. You've got to skip out the clouds and try and land straight into the pot of gold. Okay, Lee? So you go first. I'm going to go try and go straight behind you. And we'll see how close we can go together. Right, he's going in. He's going in. Right, let me try and get in. Oh, no, I'm banging into the wall. Get in, get in, get in. There we go. I'm only just behind you, Lee. I can see him there rising up behind me. So the challenge is... We've got to go off the first cloud as normal, off the second one, and we've got to try and completely skip the rainbow and land straight inside of the pot of gold. Oh, this is going to be awesome. I'm going to have a few soggy pork chops on my way up because I didn't have any breakfast this morning. And then we're going to see if we can land. And I think I'll, I'll worry about building the, uh, the entrance of the ride uh, outside of a video because... Oh yeah, I think that might be quite boring. I'm kind of just amazed that we managed to build that entire pot of gold so quickly. I don't know where Em is. I don't know if she's uh, following up behind us or anything, but uh, it'd be cool if we could have like all three of us. Like imagine getting like eight people to all ride it at the same time and just seeing them all dropping. It would actually look like like raindrops like dropping through the sky. Okay, well, we're nearly at the top, Lee. I th I'm a little bit worried I'm going to land on your head. I think you got stuck for a bit then, Lee. I'm like right behind you then. I've probably caught up with him. <laughs> oh, this is awesome. Right, let's go, Lee. Right, quick as you can. Right, this is go. Okay, we do this as normal. Then you've got to fly off as fast as you can. Just got to keep holding forward. And oh, look how far Lee's gone. I think Lee might actually make it. I'm a little bit worried I'm just going to land on his head, though. Oh, Lee didn't make it. And oh, even did I. Oh, we were both so close. We were both so close to landing straight in it. But then we both died. Let's go grab all of our stuff before it disappears. I don't know where Em is. Is Em dropping? I've no idea where she's gone. I think she might be working her way up the tunnel. Let's climb up on top of here. And let's see if we can go and see if she lands or not. Oh, yeah, there's no way up, is there? Uh, I should probably maybe put a ladder or something so you can go, go back up. Right, Em, are you on your way down? Is she coming? I, I can't see her. Right, I can see my... Oh, no, she's not. She's not gone up. <laughs> oh, well, I managed to get my boots back, and that's what counts. And, oh, look, one of the boats landed in there. I think one of the boats got in there. I think the boat landed, but I didn't. That was the problem. <laughs> I reckon if I did that again another time, I could probably, if I did it better, just about land in there. That was so close. <laughs> that was such awesome fun, though. Uh, so, sadly, we've just about run out of time in this video. Uh, in my next video, I'm going to be building a new shop. And it's going to be my most ambitious and amazing shop yet. And uh, you're going to have to find out what that is in the next video. Uh, so yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this. A uh, big thank you to Alpha Lee and M for helping me build my pot of gold. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye!